so I'm gonna put this in YouTube because there's a manhunt here in Boston, Mass. Uh, some of them has to be exact. Some guy escaped from a local uh, private jail and he's here in the city somewhere. So that should uh, be for good watching, especially if they catch them up. Wow, put it on from the news. But there's one helicopter, two helicopters, there's three, there's four. So we're literally driving to wherever this guy is because that's where the highway is. We're headed to the gym now. Oh, that's an airplane. One, two, three. Yeah, they're looking for him, but they, he must be somewhere over. Oh, no, here we go. One, two, three, four. Could that be him? Nope, just a kid. He's running with the hood on. That's him. That's him. That's him, YouTube. That's him. He's getting away, YouTube. Get him. Nope, we lost him. We're in traffic. All right. All right, here comes the project, right here. and there's the helicopter. So here you all go. See, they clean the projects up nice. Yeah, um, yeah but the old parts are. Yeah, the old part's still the old part. And the helicopters are all over the projects, and where 93 is, so they could see. You guys see the traffic too. Look, see, there's the helicopter that was falling out. Look at him. So there's a serious manhunt going on. I got them on, on, on camera. Oh, yeah. So this is... He, They're looking in the project. He's not in Cambridge that. anymore, folks. He's got to be in Sunwell. Right. Let me say that Amy and I um, pretty grew much... Up over here. Yeah, we grew up over here. So we're from the projects, basically. <laughs> <laughs> if you're from Medford and Sunwell, you're from the project. No, you're not. That's Unless you're from the Heights or from like West Medford. Then you're like no. not from no. the, the project. People do that. Look, look at yeah, me. Look I'm yeah. touching your nose. <laughs> so this is um, what the helicopters were doing earlier today. He jumped from his cruiser, running after Morales on foot, and calling it in by radio. Merrick says he lost him once, but then Morales ran out from under a porch trying to scale a fence. After uh, a foot chase, a couple of troopers have seen Morales on the run since New Year's Eve was just too tired to fight. He did, he looked exhausted. No fight left in him, no fight left in him. This is me trying to measure my own arms and it's horrible and I'm pulling as tight as possible, but uh, let's call it 15 because I'm going to do an arm workout and like you can see the skin, how tight it's pressed, so. I guess it's so hard to measure your own arm. Hold on. So, that did look funny and it took some time, but I did get it measured. Knowing what my measurements are, I was trying to make it as accurate as possible, but filming myself, so it was very impossible. But I know my arms are 15 inches because they're, they're tiny, and I want them to be... 17 18 19 inches but that's a long way down the road and and i know i got to put in a lot of work to get it but i thought it'd be cool to show you guys that the pump that you get and the pump that you're feeling while you're at the gym is a real thing and and these measurements when you wait till the end will show you that if you work hard in the gym and you get that pump you're gonna look massive that's why everybody always says chasing the pump it's literally as addicting as coffee is once you get that once you see it in the mirror and that feeling you have like all over your body you'll be hooked and then the healthy lifestyle the constant going to the gym constantly trying to get that pump you'll just be chasing it every day and and it will only make you better So I know I'm not talking about every exercise that we're doing because you guys have seen them so many times. I'm taking this opportunity to talk to you guys about where the channel, where I'm going to be taking the channel over the next few months. That's going to change 
the way hopefully it's going to change Amy and I's lives for the better and of course my kids which is why I do everything for the better so what I did is I just named each exercise that we're doing um, her and I supersetted everything a because I knew I needed to get as much pump into my arm as possible and her exercises are aesthetic for the legs this is her third leg exercise this week so I hope you guys like this feature it's a nice little feature I found on um, iMovie and it actually works out great for what this video is supposed to be for you guys so just remember when you see me the next exercise I supersetted that with the previous exercise so Amy did about five sets of everything she was working on and she's sore as hell today so and today's Sunday January 8th so she's happy with her workout and of course when you see the end of my workout I was pretty happy with mine too but I want to take this opportunity to let you guys know where we're going to be taking the channel in um, the next few months and please leave a comment let me know what you guys think or have any questions so I'm asking for comments and I'm going to tell you that I'm leaving all my information in the description box below um, I'll leave our Instagram names I'll probably tag those in one of the exercises you see and then I'll leave my email in the description box below and I'll leave Amy's email also because sometimes girls want to talk to girls but Amy and I are going to be getting our personal training certificate we're going to be focusing on nutrition meal prepping online coaching and one-on-one -on -one coaching so that's hopefully you guys are going to see this process along the way once it gets started I think in March and you'll be able to follow us through the whole thing because I'm sure it's going to be difficult especially with the kids Braden and David is going to be getting into soccer Ryland's going to be running around the field I'm sure just causing havoc so everything's going to get a lot more chaotic in my life but my life is pretty chaotic as it is now so I welcome it I know how to handle it and um, Amy and I work pretty good as a team together so that's a huge help oh. we got a half inch not a full inch right what's it say I don't know it looks like 16 oh uh, <laughs> <laughs> I'm only flexing as hard as I can looks like it's 16 and we got an inch then. That's an inch. That was that little over 15. Nice. Look at those guns. Look at those guns. I love this chick. Love this chick. Love this chick. Great. This chick. <laughs> you don't look like a funny man, please. Take a picture. Oh, hold on. Oh, wait. Ooh. I can't see my back. <laughs> right. right. Yeah. No, turn around. But I like give the middle finger because the pins. So this is the ride home from the gym. Um, it was crazy. It was slow. We took our time. We obviously got home safe and uh, we got the gym in that day. Like I always say, you grind, hustle, achieve. This is part of it. You got to hit the hard roads when it comes. And we knew a snowstorm was coming, but we went anyways. And we just figured we'd take it slow home. And uh, everybody got home safe. There was no major accidents. From what we could see, once we got to the highway, it was um, the roads were a lot better, but no excuses. You guys seen there, we did hit 16 inches. So, again, the pump is real. You go to the gym, you have a plan, you stick to it, you execute it, and you'll get results. That I can promise you. But I just wanted to say thank you to everybody for the support, everybody that comes up to me at the gym, at work. I appreciate every single one of you. Please comment, like, subscribe, and we'll see you in the next video. Talk to mm -hmm. me, right, right. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Now you're going blank? He's rolling your eyes? You just want to roll your eyes at the camera? Show How was your new jacket camera? and boots, David, in the snow? Don't bite them, baby. I came just in time, huh? Clean up. Tired. Don't bite your jacket, baby. Clean up, too, 